I'm going to bifurcate that into two issues, um, long term and short term. I think that the, in the short term, we have to really think hard about how we get the economic growth we have into the places that uh, are receding. So what do I say by that? If you look at a map of the, world, of the country and you look at the last 15 years where growth has receded and where growth has increased, a lot of that, a lot of that growth where it's increased has been very urban. A lot of the where growth has a lot of places where growth has receded are exurban and rural, and I think um, I think we have to be honest. I, I I mean Detroit has been an incredible case and uh, has gone through incredible challenges um, and is coming back. That's what I'm told, um, and that is an imp really important story. But how we get growth whether it's through infrastructure investments or um, investments in community colleges that it can attract business to those rural places and exurban places, I think is the next set of challenges. And then, you know, just to dovetail, how we, over the long term, how we have an education system, which is not a have and have not education system, but one that creates a real opportunity for everyone up the pipeline. That's important for Michigan. It's important for our country. States that do that grow and grow well. States that, for because they struggle for a while or they lose sight, stop doing that. They are the ones that are on the wrong side of economic growth.